can't believe we're already here. We started out talking about workouts for people in their 20s weeks ago. Well, now we're ending our fitness series with workout tips for people in their 60s as we get older. Health and fitness coach Candace McField is back to explain how you can push yourself at any age. Introduce us to your models. Good morning. Good morning. We have Leela today and then we have Vicki as well. Thanks for coming in, ladies. Thank you. Yeah. And you look Thank wonderful. You. This is a great time. We were talking a few minutes ago about good time to be alive because we have so many tools to help us as we get older. We do. We do we have a lot of different tools. Um, and the thing is, for the, the biggest challenge, like in the 60s, is that you know joint issues, injuries become a become a common problem. So think about arthritis. Think about back, hip, knee issues. Right. So what we want to do is try to prevent that and not let aches and pains become an excuse for not exercising. And modify, so, modify, and modify, modify, and modify, 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 it. right, exactly. So today the focus is the strength training or balance and stretching. I mean, okay. Yeah. So, so what are your top exercises for that? Top exercises. So today for balance, what we're going to demonstrate is the alphabet. So with, we're going to have Vicki doing an advanced movement. So she's going to come a little bit higher so, and Leela's going to do a beginner movement. So basically working on balance. Uh, they're going to trace the alphabet. You go, go A to Z, but today they're going to show A and B. Right so it just come up, yes. Okay. Yeah. So they're bringing their legs up. So I'm really, yeah. so for Vicky, just a smaller movement then? Yeah, it's Yours just a larger. smaller. Larger. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you throw up. That looks hard. <laughs> is it hard? I don't think I can do it. So that the, the key is, like, you know, as you're coming, working your core and you're going it's through good. that whole alphabet, you're working your quads, you're working wow. your core, but yeah. it's also a balance because you're using your leg to stabilize yourself. So the next exercise that we have is a stretch. So they're going to stretch our backs. Like I said, in this decade, okay. a lot of times is our joints are stiff and tight. So this mm -hmm. one works our, our, our back and our shoulders. So they're going to come down and just bend over a little bit. Yep, there we go. And so as you come back up, we're stretching. Okay. And then the last exercise we're going to demonstrate today is another stretch where we have the right over the left. Right. And then come down and come to that right side. And they're working their, their hip on that opposite side. So really? again, okay. for a lot of the people in their 60s who have the joint issues, this is a great stretch for the hips. Okay. Excellent. Thank you, girls. Thank you. Nice work. <laughs> yes. If you have questions for Candace, you can find her on social media. She has great advice for you. any situation if you have fitness challenges. So you can find her on her website as well, CandaceMcField.com. It's there on your screen. And you can look back at all our segments if you want to check out the others. Fox4Casey.com. Just click on Mornings.